Hello everyone, I'm Francesca and welcome to day three of our holiday recipes. I really hope you've been enjoying them so far. If you've missed one and two, go check them out. They're delicious, you don't wanna miss them. And today we are making smashed and breaded crispy Brussels sprouts. These are absolutely amazing. I feel like I'm gonna say that about every recipe, but I'm just, I'm loving every recipe that I made for this little series. I love these as a holiday appetizer because it's a great way to get a little veggie in and they look really delicious and they are really delicious. And like, who doesn't love things that are baked and breaded, like it's just really good. So I think you all will really enjoy it. Paired it with a peri-peri dipping sauce that is amazing and like creamy because we use some vegan mayo. You'll see how we do it, it's delicious. And yeah, like always, the full red out recipe is on my blog. There's a link in the description box down below for that. I also link everything that I think you might need and I also write the recipe ingredients out in the description box down below as well. So go check out the description box. And if you like new videos, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. I worked very hard on this series and I would love for it to do well and flourish. I really hope you all are enjoying it. And also if you need a gift idea, check out my cookbook Plantiful. It makes a great gift for anybody in your life, anyone who loves to cook. So yeah, with all that being said, let's get into the recipe and I'll see you tomorrow for our next one. Bye. So you're going to take your Brussels sprouts and just cut the bottom off. You're not going to have them or anything. You're just gonna leave them whole. And you're just gonna do this to all your Brussels sprouts, pop them in a microwave safe bowl, and then we are going to cover them with a quarter cup of water. You're gonna microwave them for about three to five minutes, just enough so that they get nice and soft so you can smash them. And they'll look still like fully intact when they come out, but they should be a little bit like squishy and soft. You should be able to kind of apply pressure and feel that they are a little, softer. So then you're just going to take out your holiday stress and you're going to smash some Brussels sprouts. So you can either take like a big cup or I use this little measuring cup, which wasn't a good idea because it ended up hurting my hand. Use like a nice flat bottom glass and just start to smash them. Get angry like the Hulk. So now we're going to start breading them. So we got all purpose flour, non-dairy milk, unsweetened, unflavored, and some panko breadcrumbs. And I have my baking sheet to just pop them right onto. So you're going to take it in the flour with your dry hand. Then you're gonna go into the non-dairy milk. Use your wet hand for this. Then we're gonna go into the breadcrumbs with your dry hand. I personally like to make my dominant hand my dry hand because I feel like it does more work. So just pat the breadcrumbs on and then you're just going to place it on your little baking sheet and that's it. You're just going to repeat with all of your Brussels sprouts. And if you are gluten-free, you can just use gluten-free all-purpose flour or cornstarch and you can use gluten-free breadcrumbs. And then once you kind of get to the end of the breadcrumbs, you'll see they're like kind of like wet and clumpy, but you can keep using them, don't worry. Just You're just gonna like really pat the breadcrumbs onto the Brussels sprouts and just kind of like pack it on there and, and then it will just like bake onto the Brussels sprouts in the oven. So we're going to coat them with some spray oil and just give them a nice generous coating. I like to use a spray oil because I feel like it just coats everything a lot easier. And you're going to bake them 425 degrees for about 13 to 15 minutes. Now let's make our dip. So I'm going to combine some vegan mayo, I'm using the Hellman's one, and some peri-peri sauce. And I love peri-peri sauce. It's very spicy, but very delicious. And some garlic powder, and that's it. You're just going to mix it up. And I just kind of wanted to keep this simple. You can really pair it with any kind of dipping sauce that you like. I'm giving a taste here. I want more peri-peri sauce. I want more heat in this house. <laughs> and and that's it, you know, you can put it vegan ranch with this, vegan tzatziki, there's like so many options, but I wanted to do something simple. So our Brussels sprouts are all done. Don't those look gorgeous? They're golden and crispy and they're so fun. I love the smashed part of it because they like, they look really good. So let's plate them up and, you know, just arrange them, make them look nice, get a nice pretty plate. And then you can garnish them with some coarse sea salt and a little bit of greens. If you've been here, you know I just love to put little green re on top and that's it. They're done, they're delicious, they're crispy. It's a great way to get like a vegetable in and I think Brussels sprouts are a really delicious vegetable and they're like really like, they're kind of meaty to me. I don't know, they're a hearty vegetable. And with the dipping sauce, it was really good. So I think you will really enjoy them and I think they're a great appetizer. Hello.